girls from Greece coming out. And if you do a head count, I think we'll find there's only nine of them on deck. No, oh, eight. Even eight, for that matter. So Greece beginning its routine with two swimmers already in the water. Very powerful lift, beautifully synchronised, well matched on lines and in time. Now supported splits, rocking, moving down the pool. Lovely use of the music. And the pair move back to back, very difficult to achieve. lifts excellent height above the surface of the water they're up past the mid thigh and quite a change of mood into the very powerful strong movements very sharp and angular now we see them using the percussive leg movements on the water to create their own soundtrack Thank you. Interesting move without the music creating their own music at that time because being underwater they generally rely on the underwater speakers to give them their timing for their moves. Now without the music there was none of it. No, they were all creating it all themselves. They would have been counting away in their heads to get that perfect timing those moves and then we see very complex patterns created by their legs in the inverted position. We move from the team to a duet, some interpretive feet movement. They're very playful in this section of the routine, this duet within the three combination of the team. quite difficult to achieve the fluid lines within a duet. Generally the duets are much sharper in their actions, but they're able to achieve the synchronisation while maintaining the fluidity of the movements. And they're joined by more members of the team. Back to the traditional eight formations. Another difficult move, back to back, linked with the bent leg and moving up and down in a double vertical position, changing position. And a pullover with one of the soloists performing excellent flexibility almost contorted. And very strong in the inverted verticals with a quick leg trans A lovely interplay between the solo and the team.
see very close together on the double leg movements over. The difficulty of the movements increased by how close together the swimmers are to each other. Very minor synchronisation imperfections, but a very strong routine from the Greek team. Melbourne has a very strong Greek population and they're here in their numbers tonight. And here we see the, where the girls are working under the water, performing the scully action. The judges are looking for what goes on above the surface, but below is where a good deal of to make all that extreme flexibility soloist in this routine. Soloist commanding the remaining members of the group on the circle position. Seventh placing in the preliminary round. So Greece become the early leaders. After the 